Hello, Nokoshe here, and today we are going to be breaking down the Call of Duty Black Ops 3 DLC for Salvation multiplayer trailer. Now, when I saw this trailer, I was super hyped to get these maps, so I hope you enjoy this breakdown, and let's get right into it. So the first map that they show here is a map called Outlaw. Now this is a remake of Standoff from Black Ops 2 and that's probably why it's one of my favorite maps out of these. I think it's probably my favorite out of all of them to be honest. And so they show here someone with the Annihilator just ripping through everyone and they jump into this window here, take this guy out with his shotgun and he flies out the window. You can see a really nice cinematic shot here of the sunset, the side of the house here. And then he whips out his sniper and gets a shot all the way across the map. Really nice shot. It reminds me of playing standoff with camping in that room with the DSR. I used to do that all the time. So then they show here a clip with the mothership. And it shows how deadly just running right through the center can be. You're not going to want to do that when there's a mothership around. So the next map here is Citadel. This is a really interesting map. It's very green, very lush, lots of plants and like grass and just everything is grown all over this place. It seems to take place in some sort of old ruins of a castle or dungeon type thing. And you just see here someone with the sparrow just boosting over these rocks, taking this guy out slamming him against the wall and there's also this inside place that you see someone running through with the fury song takes this guy out and then he jumps over this balcony here from this very high tower and you can see below him there's a water feature so there is going to be underwater parts of this map which is pretty cool and we haven't seen too many of those lately the next map here is micro and this is a very interesting concept. It's basically that you are pretty much the size of an ant. And you're running around this feast here of just a bunch of different foods. It seems a lot of like desserts and sodas and stuff. And it's really funny to look at. You're like super small and it seems like a very small map as well. You can fall into this little head glitch type thing here. Now it shows the flamethrower here with the purifier just going in shows some uplink gameplay there's this big sphere in the middle that you can run circles around this guy's taking out people with the tomahawk and it shows this overview of the map here just looking really cool it looks really funny it seems like a very small map as well now this next map seems awesome it's huge it's called rupture and it pans in here to a sniper in this huge tower in the middle of the map and he's just taking guys out you see him crank back that bolt and he's just taking people out but when there's a huge tower someone's gonna spot him and he gets taken out with this rocket launcher so you gotta be careful there you know you're gonna be sniping in that window and someone's just gonna spot you from across the map and everyone's eyes are gonna be on you so you have this guy running around here with the tempest he shoots at this guy gets I believe a triple kill here and it shows how you know there's this big main part of the map here it seems to be uh, three lanes as usual where there's a uh, inside rooms in the middle possibly and then this is the star shining bright of this map this is crazy it's this walker tank type thing this crazy machine that you could just run around with shoot missiles and just completely obliterate your enemies seems super fun to use and I'm very excited to be using this now you see this guy take him out with a rocket launcher I'm not sure how much health he's gonna have but it seems really fun so thank you so much for watching this trailer breakdown I hope this helped you get an insight to some of these maps.
Thank you so much for watching and have a great rest of your day.